transport workers, or, or patient people, um, people with a, a minute attention to detail. I think those are very important qualities in people. So if they can um, be patient on a day-to-day -day level, but also on a you know maybe a, a daily, weekly, monthly level, some some people can take a long time to. Um, adjust to things or get used to things or feel, feel safe in their, their community and what you don't need is, is staff without that, that level of patience and resilience to, to support people on those journeys because then what happens is you just chop and change, nothing ever works, we've done that, it doesn't work and, and then that closes loads of doors for, for people so patient people who are really up for it and who are prepared to sort of uh, travel along with people. And um, I heard a nice analogy once, somebody was talking about support workers, like sometimes they'll, they'll be, be alongside people, sometimes they might be behind people, just slightly, you know, egging them on, but they'll never be in front of them, dragging them, them in, and, and are we? Are we are we doing that sort of stuff? Are we are we dragging people into situations that? Well, probably not not that. Pro it's probably more about sort of closing situations down for people, standing in front of them so that they can't get into yeah. into those sort of things. So I agree. All that compliance stuff is really really important, um, but it's become it's become the focus. You know, um, which I guess you're right. Is it's around fear and. Um, not not wanting to to get shut down by, by um, but you know Win Winterbourne passed its tests, didn't it? And uh, it's a terrible place. So 